So we are at home number two in Stonecliff. This home is for sale. So if you're interested in Stonecliff, if you're interested in this home, please shoot us a call, shoot us a text if you're interested and we'd love to chat with you about it. We help our clients in all price ranges. So no matter the price range, no matter the home, we'd absolutely love to help you. So reach out to us. All right, let's go ahead and dive right into this one. So this home is priced at 2,900,000. There's a total of 4,696 square feet on this home. Five bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms. This home is one level with a five car garage. And obviously an RV bay. Yes, that's a, that's a huge selling point. Well, let's go check it out. And you get some bubbling rocks. <laughs> that's so cool. Office. Cake. I'm glad that they actually covered this and protected it. They haven't done it in a lot of the homes. Got a, what color is this? It's kind of a, a matte teal. Yeah. It's. I love that they're starting to do like the whole room and the ceiling. I love single town paint jobs. Never thought I would say that, but I do. What is that? Oh, it's a hidden little closet in the office. It is a closed area. I know, but it's cool. Go like this, peek in there. Nope, <laughs> this is a closet. <laughs> These windows are pretty popular up here. I love, yeah, the, the room dividers. Yeah, but they're like the indoor, outdoor windows and doors. Like they're pretty popular. Well, they were on that. Well, so the application on the inside really really helps you separate the area but at the same time it doesn't it's super airy super open so this this gym you essentially have a set of these glass french doors this whole wall could be closed off or it could be open and then that slider could be open so you'd be completely past you can up a sweat and a good workout just pop up yeah. and they've got the same wooden beam details Oh, did we even mention how cute that mirror is? I love that. It's beautiful. Okay, let's check out this one. Some of the front bedrooms. This is pretty cabinetry. Oh, it's got the magnet. Magnet doorstop, nice touch. Oh, there's also a pool house. Would this be the bathroom they used to access for the pool? Maybe not. Yeah, maybe because there's a door that separates it from this bed. Look at this shower head. Cool, and look at the, this is awesome. The handle. Handles are nice. It's all about the details. Good size bedroom. The setbacks from the street are so big that even your front feels you have plenty of privacy, and most of Stone Cliff has these rock walls for retention. I think look pretty cool. This bed looks really comfy. Looks super comfy. Let's go explore the pool house. This is a cool little exterior space. You have another little hangout area if you wanted to have it. Ooh, the pool house. Stack a little washer and dryer right there. A really cool guest suite, I guess, if you have, you know, people in town and you want them to experience your whole house, but a miniature version of it. Still have access to the pool and the views. It has a little stackable. Cabinetry is beautiful. You got a Murphy bed built in. Look at that detail. Look at the ceiling. It's got a skylight in here. Because naturally a bath that's like elongated like that could look kind of dark, but these skylights Fill it with light, perfect. Same shower head. Oh, it's like concrete. Looks like concrete. How cool. So the kitchen. This great room is pretty great. You see the little birds? Uh huh. So cute. Look at these views. These views just kind of mesmerize you. You just want to stare at them all day. Just breathtaking. Looks like there's a storm rolling in. If you look off to the north, see there's some fog coming down. Guys, the weather was crazy last night. It looks like all the snow melted, but it actually snowed here early morning. I'm gonna do another shot of this beautiful family room. Check out this kitchen. Look at the size of the center island. It's like perfectly wide. The panel fridge on the right 
two dishwashers with panel finishes on this side. Got some awesome views from the sink right here. This is so cute. Look at these cabinet doors. They're, they're see-through. Put some produce in there. Put a little coffee bar. Cute. More skylight. Lots of natural things. This skylight's in a lot of rooms throughout this house. So I think if we go this way, there's more, more living quarters that way. We have another access point to get to the pool. This is your owner suite. I absolutely love seeing all these accent walls. I was actually mid deciding on how to decorate our new office and Michonne and I have been talking about this panel look. It seems to be super trendy right now. Should we do that? I love it. It looks good. It looks so good in person. I haven't seen I've it's seen different variations of it in person. It's yeah. Painted like a matte gray behind those lines. And these planks are really high quality. I've seen different levels of finishes of this style of accent wall, but I like this one the most. These picture TV things are really getting me every time. They, they legit, I keep thinking it's just a picture. But that... Are you referring to the Samsung frame? Yes. Yes, very much so. Like they trick me every time. Well, that's what it's designed to do. I love This kind of wise through here and you have your, your master dressing. Sort of two separate separate closets actually. This one is attached to the laundry room. And there's one directly across the hallway. Let's explore this one first. My family's company. My great grandpa started this company. All the lighting in here, so cool. Um, Why this opens. The, I, where, does that go into? This goes into the laundry room. Uh, this closet that's attached to the owner's suite goes into the laundry room and there's another closet directly across. Second closet. It's not attached to the laundry room. I feel like there should have been a second laundry room. This floor We're way into the is heated. Room. Yeah, it feels wonderful, especially on a cool day like today when you're walking around the parade. Yeah. Well, let's just. Eat. That's been that's been kind of a trend across the parade is heated bathroom floors. I absolutely love it. It's a great trend. This view is like straight north. Well, and having a view straight north from your master bath, especially when you have that much glass, means this room wouldn't really ever get hot from the sun beating down on it. It's a cute little undermount thermidor microwave. A cute little sink. Do we see the whole house? Yep. Sure, so we saw, did you see all the guest suites and then the pool suite? I love the herringbone pattern. Yeah, so cute. Well, I should rephrase it. I love it in this application. It's not It's not always the way to go. Look at the size of the RV. Looks like it's about 40 feet. Pretty spacious RV. Thank you so much for tuning in and check out this video. Let us know what you think about this home. What do you think about Stone Cliff? Michelle and I are a little partial. We absolutely love Stone Cliff. It's right in the middle of town, surrounded by everything that St. George has to offer. You have 360 panoramic views, but might not be everybody's cup of tea. Let us know what you guys think about this home. What do you think about the neighborhood? Drop us a comment below this video. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure to smash that subscribe button and the notification bell right next to it so you don't miss any of our future videos. YouTube algorithm will suggest a couple more videos up here that you might find interesting. Do sure to click on those and I will see you in the next one.